Howdy y'all, we're the Coveys, but y'all can call us the Unchartered Texans. Happy 4th of July, y'all. Good morning, y'all. We're hot and tired. We're just finishing up, hooking up our dolly and getting ready to go on the road. See y'all out there. After leaving Lakey, Texas, we drove to the city of Canyon in the Texas Panhandle. For this trip, we stayed at the Paladero RV Park in Canyon, Texas. And our first night, we sure got a West Texas welcome. Being in the Texas Panhandle gave us a chance to catch up with some more family. Canyon is known for being home to the site of the oldest and largest historical museum in Texas. The Panhandle Plains Museum covers everything from dinosaurs, Indians, the Pioneer Line, and the petroleum industry. Side note, allow two to three hours to view. The oldest surviving house in Texas is here as well. Canyon is also known for the Paladera Canyon, where the outdoor musical Texas is held. We were lucky enough to be here during the Comanche Summer Special as well, which is only held once a year and features world champion Native American dancers. And you can also purchase a barbecue dinner and backstage pass for the shows. We loved exploring the Paladera Canyon and even did a short hike called the Pioneer Nature Trail. We stopped and said howdy to Tex Randall, the canyon figure since 1959. He's 47 feet tall. After that, we went to Combine City. Then we went to Amarillo and painted a Cadillac at the Cadillac Ranch. While we were out and on a hunt for cheap fuel, we stumbled across the John Stepp Memorial Park and the Madonna Lake Loop Trail. This was a perfect three quarter mile loop for an afternoon stroll. We saw prairie dogs and baby gossip. We recommend this short walk if you're in Amarillo. And then we had to stop and have dinner at the Big Texan. We took a day trip to Caprock Canyon State Park in Kittaquay, Texas. Buffalo Herd Retail Store. Then we saw the Goodnight House in Goodnight, Texas. That night, the open skies of the Texas Plains were perfect for seeing rare planetary linemen 
Five planets in the moon has not happened since the 1800s. The next day we found this white buffalo fountain while exploring the West Texas A&M campus in Canyon. We also discovered that they have a white buffalo statue at the football stadium. Afterwards we stopped by the Canyon Popcorn Company for goodies. We also recommend stopping at the Rock and Zebra Soda Shop for a nostalgic experience. It will cure your sweet tooth. Hey y'all, good evening. Our trip here in Canyon is coming to a close. I just wanted to wrap up this trip with saying if you think are thinking about moving to Canyon, um, we'll find that it is a friendly, conservative town with a small to medium sized feel. However, it's only about 15 miles outside of Amarillo, so it's got those big city amenities close by if you need them. Uh, Canyon is also a Main Street, Texas town, which means that it has a town square and it's got red brick streets um, downtown. Bye y'all. We'll see you out there on the road somewhere.